everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so this video is sort of like my first fully autumnal haul so pretty much everything in it is suitable for autumn and winter maybe as well and yeah it's just a few great transitional pieces so it's just the first big a lot of clothes I've got that are all perfect for the colder weather. So this video is in collaboration with Quiz Clothing and they very kindly sent me some bits to show to you guys and when they reached out to see if I wanted to collaborate with them I had a look through their website and I was so pleasantly surprised there were so many amazing bits so I'm really excited to show you them all. So I've got a collection of jumpers, dresses, a few pairs of boots as well and I'm just going to get straight into it. This is going to be a try on haul so everything I will be trying on for you and as always it will all be linked in the description box with my sizes as well. Hello everyone, um, I'm just jumping on here quickly to tell you that I have got a discount code for quiz. I forgot to mention it so I thought I would just insert it here. It is Amy15 in capitals and that gets you 15% off so I will put that on the screen here and I will pop it in the description box for you as well. So the first item that I got is a little polo neck and it's like a really thin, thick ribbed, camel, nudie coloured, long sleeved polo neck. <laughs> and these are so great, you can never have too many of these when it gets to autumn and winter, they're so great for layering. They're great for autumn just to pop under a leather jacket, but they're also great under big thick coat. They're just so versatile, so easy to wear, and yeah, they're great for layering. So this one I picked up in a size small, and it's just got this really nice long neck, which I love, because you can have it all the way up here, you can roll it down, it's great. And the sleeves are also so long, so I can like pull them over my hands which I just really like to do because it's quite a cosy thing to do and yeah these are perfect they're so nice to tuck in as well it's nice and long it's not cropped or anything so it's going to keep you warm and yeah I think this was a really affordable price yeah so this was 17 99 so super affordable and of course I got it in the camel colour so I had to get it in black as well so it's just exactly the same in black and I could not get this in black because I just think I'm going to get so much wear out of it black goes with everything. I go through about 10 of these a year, just plain, simple black polo neck. The next thing I got is actually a pair of trousers. They fit like a legging, they're quite nice and tight fitting, but obviously they've got a zip and a button, so they look like trousers, which is great. And they're just like this coated jean almost. I sized up in these, I actually got these in a size 10, and I'm really glad I did because they're so comfortable and so easy to wear. I always worry with coated trousers and faux leather leggings that they're going to be really tight and really hard to get on and really uncomfortable but these are not at all. They're super soft on the inside, they're really thin which makes them really wearable, really comfortable like I said. You could go out for an all-you-can-eat Chinese in these and they're not going to you know, they're not going to be uncomfortable, they're not going to cut you off, you're not going to need to undo the top button as I often do. And yeah, they've got pockets at the back, which make them even more jean-like, which I love. And they're just so versatile. These would look great with the polo necks that I just showed you. They look great with um, a big chunky jumper, much like the one I'm wearing. And they're just so versatile, so easy to wear, so perfect for autumn and winter. They look great tucked into boots. They look great with some slip-on loafers. So yeah, I'm really, really pleased with these. Did I mention what size I got them in? Yeah, I got them in a size 10 and they were £30. So next up I have a few dresses to show you. Um, now I don't, I was going to say I don't often wear dresses but that's a lie, I do. I like to, there's something about wearing like a nice cute little dress and over the knee boots in the winter and I love to do that. So I picked up a few nice dresses. Now this one is a colour that I don't often wear but it's a colour that I've actually been loving recently. I loved green throughout summer and I'm sort of carrying that on into autumn and winter now and this is such a beautiful dress. It's like a black and white leopard print pattern on the green material. It's more, much more of like a forest green than it's showing up on camera but it's like this really cute tea dress so it sits really nicely, nips you in at the waist, it's got a lovely V neckline and it's got like a nice cuff on the sleeve as well which I really like and is really flattering and it's actually um, a play suit. So I know I said it was a dress, but it's actually a play suit, but you can't tell that it's a play suit at all. It just fits like a dress, it sits like a dress. You'll see in the cutaway that 
you wouldn't really be able to tell that it's shorts underneath, which I like because I prefer the look of a dress than the look of a play suit. This is just a really cute tea dress. And like I said, this sort of thing with over the knee boots or ankle boots and a leather jacket or an aviator jacket over the top, I think just looks so cute for autumn and winter. And I got this in a size eight and it was 33 pounds. So super affordable. Now this next dress is gonna be quite hard to show you um, this, the shape of it, but you will see when I try it on, but it's just, this beautiful like chiffon dress it's got floaty short sleeve like a wrap sort of neckline um it's elasticated at the waist and then it goes all the way down into like this midi length and it's got a slight asymmetric hem and i just think this is so pretty it's really really elegant i think this sort of thing I know we're talking about autumn and winter, but this sort of thing with some black sandals on holiday it looks perfect, but also with some over the knee boots. I love that look of over the knee or knee high boots poking out from like a slip in a midi dress or something. I think that looks great. So that's how I intend to wear this with a leather jacket over my shoulders or something like that. And yeah, this is just such a beautiful dress. It's so well made. It's got a really nice tie as well at the waist so you can really nip yourself in there which is good and yeah i just love this it's so pretty and it's so different to anything that i have in my wardrobe which is great it'd be great for like an occasion if you have a i don't know like a it's too soon to be talking about christmas parties isn't it but if you have an occasion coming up then this sort of thing would be perfect and it was 35 pounds and I got it in a size small and i think it looks a lot more expensive than 35 pounds it's also lined as well it's got like a slip underneath so you don't have to worry about it being see-through so the final dress that i have to show you and actually the final item of clothing because all the rest are accessories is a blazer dress now i don't think you can go through autumn and winter without a black blazer dress these are such staple items they're so good to have in your wardrobe because you can really dress them down with some flat ankle boots or you can dress them up with black strappy heels they're just such an easy wearable statement piece they're never going to go out of style they're, they're wearable year in year out in the summer in the winter but this black one i think is great for autumn and it's long sleeved as you can see and it's got these gold button details so it's got one on the sleeves and then it's sort of got like a double breasted look on the front it also comes with a belt again so you can nip yourself in this would i think look really cool um oversized i stayed true to size and i just got a normal size eight and this one is actually petite but it doesn't fit petite at all i don't think but yeah you could size up in this and have it like a really oversized fit and then pull the belt in really tight which i think would look really cool and yeah i love this it's so like i said so easy to wear and I will really be getting my wear out of this. It's got slight um, padding in the shoulders as well, which I like not too much, but just a little bit of extra volume in the shoulders. And yeah, it's a really great quality. And like I said, just such a staple item for the upcoming month. And this was 45 pounds, which is actually such a good price for a good quality, thick material blazer dress. Now onto a few accessories that I got. So the first one is this bag. And I think this is just so, so cute. I love the shape of it. It's like this gorgeous sphere, spherical shape with this really nice gold detailing. And it, I think it just will sit so nicely on your arm, so nicely to hold. It's just such a cute evening bag. I think it would go so nicely with the blazer dress as well. This also really reminds me of like a Pauline bag. Pauline, Pauline, Pauline. I think it's Pauline. Um, yeah, it just really reminds me of one of those. And they are such beautiful, beautiful bags. So this would be a great dupe if you're looking for something like that and yeah it's such great quality it's really hard wearing so like this is not going to get bent out of shape at all and yeah i just love this i think it's so cute really different to any of the bags that i own and it's a lovely evening bag it was only 26.99 which is such a good price now the next accessory that i picked up is these super cute pearl hoop earrings i think these are so nice i don't actually own any hoop earrings this size i always stick to tiny little hoops which are not that noticeable and I kind of wanted a statement earring and I think these are it basically. I think these would look so good with like an all black outfit and just these as like a little statement and yeah they look really cute on. I tried them 
on earlier and they actually look really nice because I was a bit worried that they were going to be a bit too big but yeah they're just a really classic statement earring and I think they're so cute I can't remember how much these were and it doesn't say it on them but oh yeah it does seven pounds so that's super affordable for a gorgeous pair of hoop earrings so I'll be wearing these a lot finally on to the good stuff <laughs> well what I think is the good stuff I've got a couple of pairs of boots here to show you which I'm really really excited about so the first pair are these ones and they're like a patent croc print ankle boot um, they come up quite high for an ankle boot which I like I always like that extra bit of length I think it flatters my legs a little bit more um, they don't look that tight around the top part here but they do actually fit quite snug around the leg which I like I don't like a massive sort of gaping hole I don't think that's very flattering um but yeah I love these they've got a really nice square toe also which I think again is really flattering and a nice chunky heel so they're going to be comfortable I love I don't know what it is I just love buying boots and coats they get me so excited and I'm really excited to start wearing these I love this sort of thing with those coated jeans that I showed and a big chunky jumper these will look great also with little dresses and bare legs and yeah I'm just really excited to start wearing boots like this. And these feel like such a great quality as well. Um, they're not leather but I don't think they need to be and when I'm buying like seven or eight pairs of black ankle boots uh, this season then I need them to be a little bit more affordable. So these definitely are. I don't know how much they were but they weren't too expensive and I will obviously link them in the description box so you can check there. But yeah, I really love these. They're going to be so comfortable and so great to wear. I really like the fact that they're patent as well. I don't have many pairs of patent boots and I just think that that makes them look... I don't know, I think it makes them look a little bit more luxurious, which I really like. So I just stayed true to size in these. I just got my normal size, which is size 38, and they fit great. So the next pair of boots that I got is something quite different for me, actually. I don't own anything like this, but it's just these sort of knee-high heeled boots. And yeah, I've wanted a pair of these for ages. I wanted a pair last winter and I just never got around to it because they were all really quite um, expensive and I didn't think that I was gonna get my wear out of them. But these I think are beautiful. Again, they've got a really nice square toe and that same shaped heel actually, which I really love. They've got a zip all the way up the inside. And yeah, they, these sit just below my knee, which is exactly where I wanted them to sit. And yeah, I just think these are great. They're such a statement boot. They're a bit different from the tight fitting over the knee sort of sock boot, which I love. They've got a little bit of sort of excess space around the knee, which is great. And they're a really soft material. So I feel like they're gonna wear and they're gonna mold really well the more you wear them. And yeah, I'm really pleased with these. They're such a great statement boot. Like I said, I think they look great with dresses, even longer dresses. Like this with like a knitted two-piece, I think would look perfect. And yeah, I'm really excited to wear these because I've wanted a pair like this for so long. Again, I stayed true to size in these and they fit great. They're so comfortable as well. They've almost got like this padding on the inside, which makes your foot fit into them really nicely and it makes them really comfortable. I actually tried both of these pairs of boots on with no socks, just bare feet, which I know is a little bit gross, but I couldn't bother to put socks on. And they were really, really comfortable. Usually I find the inside of boots sometimes can be a bit harsh on your feet, but these were really cushioned inside, as were the other ones. So I'm really happy about that. And yeah, I think these are probably my favorite item from the whole haul. And if you're looking for a pair of boots like this, then I know that some of them can be quite expensive. Like I think Zara do a pair for like 120 pounds, which is quite a lot of money to spend on a pair of boots. So if you're looking for a far more affordable dupe, then definitely pick up these ones. So that is everything that I got from Quiz. I really hope you guys enjoyed that haul and love the pieces as much as I do. If you decide to get anything from this haul, please let me know in the comments because I love to know if you guys buy anything that I've suggested. So thank you so much to quiz for sending me these pieces i love them all and i'm really excited for the colder weather so i can get wearing them if you did enjoy this video please give it a like and don't forget to switch on the little notifications bell so you can get notified when i upload a new video um, i've got loads of great autumn and winter bits coming so stay tuned for that and if you are new i would love it if you subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys soon with another video